What's going on, guys? Nogalea here. And today we're back with another Pokemon Pearl, uh, Pokemon Shining Pearl episode. Make it firm that you are qualified to challenge the Pokemon League. Today we're going to try to take on first Pokemon League member. To do so, I'll need to give me your gym badge that you've gathered around Sinnoh. Warburg City's Hall Gym, Eternal City's Forest Badge, Bellstone City's Couple Badge, Pistoria City's Fin Badge, and Hearthum City's Relic. Kenelave, Mon, Snow Points, Icicle, and finally Sunny Shores Beacon Bay. Here we go. We just gained access to the Pokemon League. Very well, trainer. You've indeed collected all the uh, badges of Sinnoh. Demonstrate the power that brought you here and go for glory. I'm a little afraid, but I think this team is capable. Definitely capable of doing it. It's gonna be a little bit luck based. I mean, as far as like. I'm gonna have to hope for like friendship rocks and stuff like that, so let's see what we can do. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon, to the Pokemon League. I'm Aaron of the Elite Four. It's good to meet you. Okay, I should explain. I'm a huge fan of both Pokemon. Both Pokemon are nasty, mean, and yet they're beautiful too. Uh, would you like to know why I take on challenges in this room? It's because I want to per I want to become perfect, just like a bug Pokemon. Okay, let me take you on. So Aaron is the first uh, Elite Four member we're taking on. Like I said, this is uh, it's kind of like a bittersweet thing seeing this series in. I've been on it for so long, but it is good that we finally got the Elite Four coming up with it. I think we're about five, six episodes left in the series. It just depends on how much uh, stuff is left after this. So I'm gonna go ahead. Try to hit him with a fire blast. I do have a Jolly Nature Rapidash, so I'm more than capable of. Uh, I'm more than capable of running an actual competitive field. Does he have leftovers? Black Sludge. Okay, so. Uh, let's try to do a fire blast again. Yeah. Let's go ahead and take it. So, I know for. Wait, how did he survive? How, 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 did, how did he survive with that one HP? What just happened? <laughs> what is going on? Okay. Uh, I don't know what the hell that was. That, okay, that really put a damper in my, uh, my strat. Okay, it's super effective, critical hit. Uh, let me do this real quick and respond to this. Alright, had to respond to this fast. Sorry about that. Uh, Charon wants to learn Solar Beam. I don't think I want to teach you Solar Beam. I'm pretty... Uh, actually... What's the accuracy? 100 and then 120. Lowers attack and defense. We need to get rid of Petal Blizzard if any kind. I guess we'll do that. I don't know if I just made a mistake, but I mean, I guess we'll find out when we go to use Solar Beam. Uh, I think Charm does have some usages in this run. I think we can continue to do this. Now, as far as like for this team, I don't think Pachirisu will really benefit my team too, too much. Still a Pokemon on my team that I could at least try to get some uh, some paralyzes with. This is gonna hurt. That damn near killed me. Okay, so that's gonna do a lot. No, it actually did not do much, to be honest. It did burn him though, so that's perfect. Wait, is he? Oh, he got burned by flame orb. Hmm. Now I can swap out. Oh, actually, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna swap out, go to Empoleon, try to get Petco. Because only I, I do have to worry about Earthquake though. It's, it's a lot to me, or a decent amount. Side. Okay. Perfect. He's taking burn damage. He's also uh, 
super fake and gets real fake. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. We need, we literally, with this team, we need runs like this. We need absolute 1 HP uh, surviving runs. So, um, I don't remember their movesets way too well, but I do remember that Rapidash and Empoleon are literally like my ace Pokemon for this fight. Uh, we'll go ahead and swap back to uh, Rapidash. I'm a little, I'm a little worried. Just, a, just a little bit. We still got four Pokemon left. Does he have three or four left? Three left. Okay, so Perno, I don't even know if it's worth even using at this point. Uh, we should go for another Fire Blast. Like I said, I do have a Jolly Nature uh, Rapidash, so I'm more than capable of running an actual competitive build for it. It's just that I uh, got a little lazy at the end of this fight, okay? I just want to go ahead and fight the Elite Four. Um, but if it does get to a point where I'm like, okay, I can't beat it, then we might have to switch to the competitive build. Alright, so the Lord of Veil, what is that? Um, this move reduces damage from physical special moves for five turns and it can only be used in a hail storm. So we can use that and do with hail, but we're going to do a little bit hail like, kind of thing. So unfortunately, sorry Aurora Bell. Let me know down below if I just made a mistake, but uh, that's the queen, okay. Uh, okay, so two nervous to eat berries now. Good thing I don't have any berries. This is my last one. Hopefully one shot, it did not one shot, so let's see if we can get out of this. I forget the name of that berry. It starts with a citrus berry. Okay. Very nice. This is gonna hurt. Okay, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, damn, it's just the fact that I don't. I was just about to say we're just gonna have to hope Inferno hits. That's unfortunate. Um. I kind of figured that Inferno wasn't going to be a good, really a good mode to even have. I'm probably going to have to get rid of that just to be the next going Pokemon, to be honest. Uh, let's try Drill Pack. I think I'm faster than you. Perfect. Uh, we are dead, though. Unless they miss. I don't even know if that move can miss, but it didn't look like it did too much damage. Um, we'll go ahead and kill the uh, frost guys. Uh, so far, this is going smoother, though. I, I figured that... No, I didn't figure, but I, I was looking at the teams earlier, and I was like, out of all of them, this one's going to be the easiest. Um... I uh, know that Flint's going to be quite the task for me. Dragon, Dragon, uh, is that a Dragon type? Not a Dragon type. It's a... What's it look like again? Okay, no, this is a Poison. I actually forget. We're going to have Lunch out this. Oh, fuck. He was, po he was Poison something. I just can't remember. He was faster than me, though. So we didn't even get the Hex off. I mess up. I mess up because I don't know these damn Pokemon's typings, nor do I know their weakness. So he's two times weak against ground. I now know that. Okay, that's um, not gonna help me because I'm gonna try to bounce. This is gonna kill me. Okay, good. Uh, we did get Q Charm off on him. Don't know how much that's gonna benefit me, but we're gonna try this. Okay, that is amazing because 
now I'm gonna take this opportunity to try to revive, uh, not try to, but I'm going to revive Rapidash. And uh, bring him back in just so we can try to, um, so we can try to kill uh, Sam Drapion. This is literally perfect. I made sure that I, uh, whenever I was like catching these Pokemon, the Punny, I had to make sure that it had like Q Charm because that was gonna come with clutch. At some point, it had to. Uh, it's paralyzed and it had Q Charm. Like, that was a busted uh, combination it had on it. Oh, we. Oh, no, no, no. We can't actually stack paralysis and. Okay, because this isn't a um, status move. This is gonna fucking hurt. That fucking killed me. Okay, how about that? <laughs> uh, I'm, just, uh, I'm definitely fumbling, but I'm trying to come back. It didn't even, yeah, fiery vortex didn't even get the last. That's unfortunate. Uh, this takes what, a turn to turn attack. Uh, let, let's just bring back Damn Napoleon. That's like the only way we're gonna take this damn thing out. It having Earthquake is definitely putting. Um, it having Earthquake is definitely making this a little difficult. We're gonna. Damn, I did not mean to do magic things. I meant Elite Seed, but. Because it's got cross poison, so it's gonna go harder. Okay. What? Is what we can do? Uh, do we even I mean, could we could be paralyzed? Let's see. We could get a leaf seed off and get paralyzed and swap out to Polyon. But that's not gonna happen. <laughs> that's not gonna happen. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. But we did get a leaf seed off and he is paralyzed, so. Nonetheless, uh, we are. Decent and looking good with 12 minutes in, so this video is gonna be too too long. Hydro Peg, Arc, pre turn, pre heal. Green, amazing. Okay, what do you got to say? Not yet, your first Pokemon League victory doesn't come easy, kid. Aren't you a kid? I'm gonna go ahead and use this. And that did not kill him. It's gonna hurt. That killed me. What the hell is going on? All right, we're gonna have to switch to Patrice when you switch, because that's the only way. Oh, wait, does Swift go first, or does it never miss? I forget. It never misses. Uh, we need something that. This is not good. This is terrible, man. He's gonna heal up and then not even gonna. This is annoying. Ah, fuck, we had him. Oh, what? Whoa, whoa. Okay. I'll take it. I'll take it. I guess the punny was faster. That was a long pause, too. I don't know what that was for. I will now concede the people. But I think you came to see the how great bug type of them could be. I hope you realized that you're up against the Pokemon. Battling is a deep and complex affair. Seven grand. This dude. Yeah. I lost with the most beautiful and toughest of the bug Pokemon. We lost because I wasn't good enough. That's it. Back to training camp. It's, it's here for me. No, that was wrong. Yeah, anyway, go on to the next one. Three more trainers are waiting for you. They're all tough to me. I absolutely believe it. But. We'll see what the next trainers are talking about in the next episode. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe for more. And as always, guys.